Concerning me and viewers and NBA fans all around the world, what is up? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion. And I want to talk about this whole series between OKC and the Los Angeles Lakers. OKC has finished the LA Lakers. Four games to one. The Lakers are out. This thing got done right here in Oklahoma City. And the hometown crowd was just out of control in a good way. In my personal opinion, first of all, my personal opinion only. Not alleging facts, not going to say it's personal. For entertainment purposes only. Please check the scrimmage. The crowd was shouting, OKC, OKC. OKC and, and and then it was like they had people on the outside of the stadium and they were you know all excited and stuff like that I mean this crowd was really feeling it in my personal opinion and supporting their team and I mean you know you had the whole situation there for OKC with Westbrook and Harden and Kevin Durant scoring so many points and I just feel like they outspeeded the Lakers and they just wore them down and there was just too much energy too much youth too much movement and then you think about this Derek Fisher Playing for OKC. I mean, think about that. Think about the irony of that with Derek Fisher being, you know, on so many of those great Laker teams and now to be on the team that took the Lakers out of the whole situation. And Kobe Bryant scores 42 points, then goes to the bench. Didn't even finish the game, dude. Okay, he got his minutes in there and everything like that. But in my personal opinion, do you feel like he scored that last uh, bucket there to get the 42 points and maybe kind of give him that little bit of psychological edge over LeBron? Do you think that that had anything to do with it because LeBron scored 40 points and then went, bottom line is, you lost and LeBron won. In my opinion. Now, whoa, dude. I mean, there's a lot of camaraderie after the game. People talking it. That's cool. But, you know, think of the impact to Kobe Bryant. What's going to happen now with this Los Angeles Lakers team? And what about OKC? How are they going to do in the next round against versus the Spurs? This is a big win against the Lakers. But the Spurs, in my personal opinion, have had the edge on OKC in the regular season. And the Spurs are on a complete roll right now. Ginobili, Duncan, Parker, all that whole situation there. Popovich, now, but, but whew, man, Kevin Durant, dude, and his mom was there, and everything, I mean, in Westbrook, I mean, there's a lot that the OKC's feeling right now. Do you feel like OKC's at a different level? And what's going to happen with the Lakers? Are they going to break up that team? Paul Gasol, Meta World Peace, you know, Bynum, uh, 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 obviously, you know, Kobe Bryant. What happens now? I want your reaction. The NBA expert is going to have, Paul Villarreal is going to have uh, his uh, report and reaction. That may be, he's working on that right now. And then we're going to talk again. So there's a lot more to discuss about this. Stay tuned for all that. I'm John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion. You're watching Concerning the Media. Please rate this video up. Also, please post it to your social networking sites. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.